Hi guys, it's Paul here and I just got back from JB Hi-Fi's. It's the 1st of November here in Australia. I think it's the 31st in the US. And the GoPro Hero 3 Silver Edition appears to be available in Australia now. I got this from JB Hi-Fi's. There is the price and I picked this up from JB Hi-Fi's. So uh, they've got it at the moment for $378. I picked it up for $367. So the... Uh, sales attendant was happy enough to give me a bit of a discount so i'm quite pleased with that now you're probably wondering why did i go for the silver edition firstly it was the only one that was available so i convinced myself i don't need the black edition and worst case scenario when the black edition comes out if i do need the functionality of the black edition which was the higher resolution as in 4k video recording um, or the higher frame rate uh, uh, this one here will record uh, 1080p uh, but only at 30 frames per second whereas the um, Hero 3 Black Edition will actually record it at uh, 60 frames per second and obviously you've got other frame rates you can actually pick so um, depending on what your, what your needs are uh, the Black Edition may be the one to go for so we'll get stuck into the unboxing and um, see what exactly comes with this Okay, so there you go, the box, uh, it's pretty much empty, and we'll get stuck into the star of the show. Okay, so there you have it, the GoPro Hero 3, uh, silver edition, um, on off I assume. Uh, record and stop uh, this will be the Wi-Fi button so um, we'll go through all that um, look, look looks considerably lighter actually I might do a quick weight test and compare it to the um, the GoPro Hero 2 but we'll get into that in a minute let's see what else came with it some warnings about the LCD backpack which we won't be using um, I'll probably go down a path of using the um, iPhone since I've already got an iPhone so let me update the product, so I need to update it. You would think they would have done that at GoPro. Uh, manual, and that's pretty much it. What else comes with it? Okay, so we have the non-waterproof casing for the back I assume that's just for the audio recording so you get better audio quality we have one of these gizmos uh, the extensions these are really handy oh they provide us this guy too I had to actually buy one of these before these are really really handy and the new uh, wing aircraft I'm going to be producing will actually use one of these mounts instead uh, a little battery gosh that's way different to the uh, other GoPro USB cable and we have two mounts so we have the uh, rubber insert uh, we also have a flat mount and the curved mount which no one seems to use I think if you had it on a motorbike or something like that you may use that but I don't know anyone that actually uses those I've got heaps of these left over so yeah and we have GoPro stickers Three of them. Okay, the uh, first drama I had was I tried to remove this uh, battery compartment. Clips in place like so. Now to take it out, what you've got to do is pull that back. But it doesn't pop off. So the only way I could actually... So the only way I could actually get it off was actually get a bit of tape on it. And basically pull that back and then lift the lid off okay now that should allow me to uh, get my battery in there it goes in like so that's in and that appears to have locked in place so the battery is in now we can go about weighing these guys Okay, the GoPro Hero 3 
comes in at 173 grams in its waterproof casing. The GoPro Hero, the GoPro Hero 2 comes in at 187. So obviously if you're using the casing, it's not gonna make much difference as far as weight goes. GoPro Hero 2 comes in at 97. Now this guy's a little bit tricky to get off. It's got this little slider that you need to pull back or push forward before you lift this piece here up. So that goes forward, this pulls up, and then this comes out. Let's change a little. GoPro Hero 3 at 73 grams as opposed to 97 grams. So in your hand when you film, there is a significant weight difference. So obviously for model aircraft, um, quadcopters, tricopters, hexes, etc. And as you can see size-wise, uh, there is a significant difference. About the same there, and turn it over. You can see where it's quite a bit smaller. So um, definitely smaller and lighter. Micro SD, obviously, we're gonna need. Uh, you've got your mode button here. Record, uh, Wi-Fi. And what have we got here? So what we have is your HDMI uh, and also your micro SD and your USB connector. So I need a micro SD card. I should have one lying around somewhere. I'll have to get a decent sized one. But um, there you go, the GoPro Hero 3. I'll do some video tests with it soon and compare it to the GoPro Hero 2. Remember this is the silver edition. Um, and we'll see how we go. Thanks for taking time to watch this video and hopefully I'll get a video up soon. Don't forget to thumbs up, subscribe and um, comment. Thank you. Compare it to the, um, the GoPro Hero 2, but we'll get into that in a minute. Let's see what else came with it. Empty. Oh, 